my name is Piper. Today I'll be showing you how to make one of Iran's traditional dishes, shish kebab. Iranian food is a very important part of Iranians' life and culture. Shish kebabs were made over millions of years ago. In the 17th century BC, shish kebabs were cooked on fire dogs that are made out of clay. Shish kebabs literally mean skewers of roasted meat. Tradition has it that the dish was invented by medieval Persian soldiers who used their swords to grill the meat over the open field fire. Today, this Middle, and Middle Eastern dish is one of Iran's traditional dishes that is made and served very often. Food in Iran is a fundamental part of Iranian heritage. The ingredients for the dish are pretty simple, and now I'm going to show you how to put it all together so you can enjoy this recipe at home too. The typical meat they use is lamb, but another favorite is steak. Today I'll be making filet mignon skewers, which is steak. With a variety of vegetables, here, here is what you will need. Five to ten wooden skewers that have been soaked in water for an hour so they don't burn. An outdoor grill or an indoor one. I'm going to use an indoor one that goes right onto your stove and you will need to preheat your stove and grill to medium high. Two, you will also need two onions cut into quarters, two yellow peppers cut into quarters, two red peppers cut into quarters, two I mean, cherry tomatoes, and it is very important for all the vegetables to be the same size so they cook evenly. The filet mignon to be cubed and all the same size so the beef cooks evenly too. Salt, pepper, olive oil, and a little cumin to give it some spice. Once everything is all cut up, you are, you are ready to thread the meat and the vegetables onto the wooden skewers. You can put the vegetables all on one skewer and the meat on a different skewer. And, or you can alternate the meat and vegetables on the same skewer. That is how I'm going to do it. So you so you're thread all the meat and vegetables onto all of your skewers. want to alternate so they're not all smushed together and you want it to be as far down as you can get it but you don't want to mush them all together. You want about four pieces of steak on each shish kebab, on each skewer. done and then once you're done you want once you're done you want to put it on any sort of plate like this and you want to put a pinch of salt a pinch of cumin, and a little bit of olive oil. Okay. Now you are ready to start grilling, depending on how hot your grill is. You are going to grill the skewers about five to seven minutes on each side. All done.
take it off, you just slide your finger like that onto a plate. All done and ready to go. This is one of Iran's traditional beef shish kebabs recipe. And I'm going to serve it over couscous, another traditional Iran recipe.